Hello everyone. Welcome to HBN Infotech Tutorials. In this tutorial, you will learn how to create a 3D floor plan with cut section view in SketchUp. I will show you some easy techniques to draw a 2D floor plan and convert it into a 3D floor plan with minimum efforts. Now let us have a look at the prerequisites. First, you will need to select feet and inches as the units of measure. This can be done by selecting an architectural template at the time of launching SketchUp application or you will need to go to the window menu then click on model info then click on units and then select architectural from the drop down then close the window. The second thing is to switch to parallel projection view by going to the camera menu and clicking on parallel projection view. The third thing you will need to have is a well measured 2D hand sketch or a computer generated 2D plan like this one. Ok, now let us see how to draft this uh, 2D floor plan. First you will need to switch the view to the top view by clicking on this icon. So if you are not able to see this toolbar, you can go to the view, click on toolbars, then scroll down and check the views option and click on the close button. Now let us delete this object. Then let us move the screen using the hand tool. Since we are going to draft in this area, let us move this to the bottom corner. Now let us draw the outermost line of the outer wall. Once done, select all the lines using the select tool and offset it for 9 inches using the offset tool. Then using the line tool, close the ends of the walls. Now to create the inner wall, use the tape measure tool to create guides. Once after creating the guides, use the line tool and trace over the guides. If you feel messy with too many guides, you may delete them by going to the edit menu and clicking on delete guides option. Once done, make a duplicate copy of the walls. I have a reason for doing this. In the duplicate copy, delete the lines as shown. Once done, go to the first copy of the floor plan and create the windows.
At this point, we are done with the 2D plan. Now switch to the isometric view. Now using the push pull tool, extrude the wall up to 3 feet. Since we are going to create cut section view, we are going to create the wall up to the window level only. Now the easiest way to populate this floor plan is to import ready made 3D models. I have a set of doors, windows and furniture related to this project. Now let us see how to import and arrange them on this 3D floor plan. To import, go to the file menu, click on import, then select the file you want. Select the file type as SketchUp files and click on import button. Good news is that you can download these 3D models on my website for free. After the import, right click and explode the 3D models. Now place the windows on the 2D floor plan Now select all the windows and move them 3 feet high in Z direction. Then pick a corner point and move the windows on the 3D walls as shown. Now arrange the doors and furniture as required. You may create some extra geometry if required.
to create an animation go to view menu animation and click on add scene now you may change the position pose view etc and create more scenes as required Once done, go to the view menu, animation and click on the play button. You can see a smooth animation transition from one scene to another and thus an animation. Ok viewers, it's time to say goodbye. Please like this video and share with your friends. I'll see you all in another awesome video tutorial on floor plan soon. Until then, it's bye from hbninfotech.com.